Well, meanwhile, another ruling that's been in place for decades involving decision making for laws has been overturned by the Supreme Court. A local political analyst reacting tonight to the ruling saying it could create gridlock for legislation. Brianna Malone joins us now in the studio. Brianna. This Ray Sean, an analyst of Gannon University, says the ruling could lead to more clashing for interest groups and even slow down legislation. Chevron is a rule that was issued by the Supreme Court in 1984 that allowed federal agencies to interpret laws that were ambiguous and unclear. That's according to Dr. Joe Morris of Mercyhurst University. He says that interpretation became law of the land, but now there has been a shift of power. What the most recent ruling does for us is essentially say that that's no longer the case, that there may be ambiguity in laws, places where laws are unclear, but it's the courts that ultimately get to decide what the law means. Morris says the new ruling could create an issue for legislation. The federal agencies have to interpret the law. Laws are ambiguous. They're written by lawmakers who hide unresolved conflict in the language that they use. If every single ambiguous piece of legislation has to be subject to judicial interpretation, that means our courts are going to have a whole bunch of work that they didn't have in the past. A political analyst of Gannon University says the ruling in 1984 previously did not have to be specific about how laws are applied in the real world. What it does is it requires Congress to actually do its job <laughs> because to pass legislation, it's easier to pass legislation if you're less specific. Bloodworth says the ruling could lead to a slowing of legislation for federal agencies. So asking members of Congress to know all the legislative details and to put that into the legislation and then assuming that members of Congress are going to read pending pieces of legislation that closely is, is, is expecting a lot. Bloodworth also says the new ruling is more democratic and will make the already hyperpartisan politics even more so. Jen. All right, Brianna Malone in the studio. Thank you, Brianna.